Hello everyone, today I'm here for CC Design, the November preview day three. And we are showcasing the little seals. And I use that sentiment along with the coordinating dies. They are so cute. And I also use the quad collage die, the new uh, snow die and the winter scene slimline die for that little hill. Here's my card and my card base is a four and a half by six and I dress the inside a little bit more than usual. So I have the same uh, two layers that I'll have on the front, I'll have it inside too. Here, I'm just gonna line that up and have a nice little white border around and I'm just gonna glue the little hill to that panel. And just line it up. There you go. Now I'm gonna trim that little piece that's extra off and just glue it inside. There you go. And I'm just gonna glue my little seal down. And put my snow, I love that die. And you need a nice fine tip glue for that. Just makes your job a little easier. And put a little slight on a slant and just hold it just for a bit. I also used the alphabet. I'm not sure the name I'll have the information for all these product, uh, all the products that I use on my blog. And I always um, attach my blog to all my videos. So if you're interested in that, you can just head over there and get all the information there. So I'm just gonna put the day on there. I could also use the stamp and just heat emboss it. I didn't think of it, but I think it, it turned out cute. So it's all die cuts. Just put the Y down. And there. I'll also put a little snowflake just to dress it up a bit. As it says, a snow day. So here I'm putting a little gem on it and I'm gonna glue it down. There you go. So I'll be putting the same two panels down. So. I'm not raising any panels this time. I'm just gonna be putting it just flat. So here is the collage die. And I used a really fine two-sided tape. Just makes the job a lot easier, I find. And just gonna line it up. So you wanna put your panel just a little bit smaller than your top piece so then it's a little easier to um, line it up and I'm just gonna glue that and turn it over because I want the bigger bigger spot on the bottom for the two little seals and I bring the broken china in and I'm just gonna put a little bit of ink I'm not putting lots I just want a little different because the frame is white, so I didn't want where the the lettering is to be white too. I just want a little bit of difference, not much. So there, and I'm just gonna put it a little bit of glue and just pop it in place. Super easy. Here's my first little seal for the top. They're so fun to color. 
and you can do them different colors too if you look at seals there's more gray or white even so that little heel I used that same die as the one inside for the heel and I used the collage one the quad collage one to cut it so it has a nice uh, so it fits a lot better that's all so there's my two um, ones that I'm going to color here and I start this little seal and with the W1 I always put the the lighter shade just so it's easier for me to blend uh, a lot of people put the darker to lighter it's whatever works for you nothing you know it's not in stone like this you know whatever works for you so here I got the W6 and I'm just gonna put a little bit all over just you know all around Hope you're liking all this uh, the preview days that we had so there's three days so this is the last day they are in the store already uh, here I have the W4 yeah I did a card for mm, for Wednesday sorry so that was the first day with the little snowman yesterday the little um, otters oh my goodness otters so I'll be doing those for my posting instead during the month. So here I'm just bringing a little bit more the W4. And here I did do it my first one with the W2, but it just ran out. So I put a little bit of W1 and I now I brought the W3 in. So yeah. So if you don't have the W3, you can W2 will work as uh, the other ones. That's what I used. But yeah, I really I do like it, the way it came out with the W3. Anywho, so here I got my pencil and I'm going in and we'll trace all around. Put around his little mouth, his tail, all over. Yeah, I had the card on Monday, uh, Monday, on Wednesday for the the little um, snowman. I colored them all. I almost used them all. If you didn't see the video, I had fun with that one. They were so cute um, and super easy to color the little snowman because you can do it. You can do it with just a marker or with pencils. I did them a little different than usual and yeah they worked out perfect. So here I'm just dragging my color in now with the Gamsol and my nib. And like I said you can do them more a gray. This is like a brownish gray. Uh, if you google them there's all kinds of different shade of little seal you can go with. And just blend it in there. We're almost done here. And I cut off where I showed. Did a mistake. So now I'm just bringing in the um, w1 and now I'm gonna bring the w6 and go all around and for this one I'm gonna do that one that I'm color right now a little darker so I bring in the six the other one I won't bring the six in there's not that much difference I could have went a little darker on him so now I bring the W4 and I'm going to drag those two together and blend. And just 
bring it out a little bit more too. How adorable are those two? They're so sweet. I know, I say that all the time. All sweet and cute. Probably think, oh, she's annoying with her sweet. That's just the way I am. I, I just love little characters and little cartoons. If it brings a smile to your face when you're coloring it and you're enjoying it, it's all good. That's how I feel. So I'm just bringing in now my W3 and I'm just gonna sh um, finish them off with that color. So it's blending until I'm happy with it. And now I bring in my W1 for the base again. And go all around. These ones are a little easier if you do want to add some white around the eyes. I did that for my first one and they are so cute like that. But I just found that my other ones didn't have the white so that's why I redid it again and didn't add the, the white. But you can do them either way. And they turn out okay on both, both, both ways, yeah. So I was the W4, now I got the W3, and I'm just gonna drag that out a bit more. And for this one, I'm gonna finish it off with the W1, but I'll have to use um, the W3 and drag it with it, like when, you know, when you touch the nib. Yeah, you'll see that in a moment. Just finish the little tail. So there, I got the W1 and as you see, it doesn't want to blend as nice. So if you just touch your nib on the W3 and pull it, it helps. So it just makes it a little bit lighter. So I'm just going to finish it off. And I have the little tail to finish. And I'll start bringing my pencil in. So the same as I used it for the first one that I did. So I'm gonna try to do this one a little darker so I'm a little heavier with the pencil on this one. As I said, I could have went a little darker. So there was, you know, a little bit more contrast. So now I just bring that nib in my Gamsol and I just blend that in. Should have some music. Some Christmas music would be cute. The only thing is if I have music, I might start saying, you don't want to hear that. Don't. So I'm just blending that. Now I'm going to start tracing my one on the bottom that's lighter. And I, as you can see, you don't see the pencil as much on this one. Also, I didn't do the tail on the other one. You'll see, uh, I'll do that right now. Make it a little darker. So there. Now I'm just gonna blend that one finish him off I did my card class for next week so I might have a video up for next week we'll see we'll see And if you don't want to miss anything from CC Design, just subscribe to this channel. Um, 
Yeah, so then you don't miss anything. All the goodies and all the updates. Now I'm just bringing in my gel pen and just fixing the highlights in their eyes because I did get a little bit of marker on them just to brighten them up. And also on the nose too. I'll get the nose after. They are so sweet. There you go. They're done. There. Now I'm going to cut this one a little bit so he fits in there and tuck it in. Tuck it tuck him in. And I'll put a little bit of glue on the bottom and then I'm going to Put a pop dot, a foam dot, and so he's a little bit raised too. And I put some snowflakes, and here is my little guys. So the card base is pretty simple. I didn't go all wild on you this time. So there, there. So then, you know, the little seals are the showcase here. And they should be. They're so sweet. But there. I'm going to bring in back the stamp just to show you the new set and along with the coordinating die and the new snow die. And I hope you had fun this week with all our preview day and you like my card and I'll see you soon. Bye!